Hello out there in Wonderland, this is Monterey Jack. Yeah, you can call me Jackson, but I prefer Jack. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm live here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Yes, so far anyway. And um, I have true stories for you from back in the day. I've had requests to uh, go backwards, farther, like when I was in the military, and then I've got requests to go forward into the 70s. Uh, so today I'm just going to do a quick spine or overview of 1970. Uh, yeah, it was a big year for me. I got a job at the Dunes. Back in the day it was a very good job. Make uh, a lot of money. And uh, so in 1970, I bought a house, I bought a car, I bought a boat, I bought all the furniture for the house. I put in a 40-foot swimming pool. Yeah, we were rocking and we were rolling. Had a lot of parties, a lot of parties at that house. Always 15 to 20 people. I have realized, of course I realized it many years ago, when you've got money, you've got so many friends. Oh my gosh, it's just hard to even count them. And then when you don't have money, it's hard to find anybody. Yeah, it's hard to find them. They're all gone, swept away into their own oblivion. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. Anyway, yeah, some of my house parties back then were really wild and crazy. Uh, we had a lot of food. There were a lot of people from a lot of different places of work, uh, managers at, at meat markets, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So we'd have these long tables, uh, at least two six-foot long tables out on the patio, and there would be Italian food. There would be uh, lobster, steak and lobster, yeah, uh, the meat man, and. Uh, so, oh, there's so much food, it's just unbelievable, you know, all the salads, etc., etc., etc. So, this was just to, to have a party, it wasn't anything, it wasn't Thanksgiving, it wasn't Christmas, it wasn't, yeah, it was just, let's do it. You know, so, uh, during these parties, there were quite uh, crazy activities, as you might imagine, as the night went on. Quick little thing, I had a, I went to bed early during one of the parties and I had this nightmare. And uh, so I ran out to the swimming pool, there's probably 15 to 20 people like I said before, usually that amount. And uh, I went out, uh, I had this riot shotgun, and, and just automatic. and. I went out and I said, get out of my house. And I, went, <laughs> I think I was still sleeping. Oh my God, this was horrible. And uh, I'm waving this shotgun around. Everybody left. They were, man, they were running out of the house. And uh, my dad was there and he even left without his shoes. <laughs> I'm so sorry I scared everybody like that. The gun wasn't even loaded, you know. But, yeah, to, nobody knew that. And, uh, yeah, I, I paid a lot for that, doing that, because I was so mad at myself, I can't tell you. Anyway, a lot of actions like that in 1970s, or early, even the early 70s. Yeah, it went on for quite a few years. And uh, yeah, at that time, my roommate, Virginia, she, uh, Later on in years, became my wife. Yeah, we started out as roommates and went from there. A lot of stories to tell, and probably some of them I can't tell over mine this way because they're not like to put me in jail or anything, but they're just uh, maybe a big R rated. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody wants to hear that. Everybody's experienced certain things like that. I do believe. So anyway, this is my little story today. And uh, I hope all of you have a great weekend. And 
Lots of yummies mm -hmm, mm -hmm. for your tummies. And now I say, I want to be around to pick up the pieces when somebody breaks your heart. Somebody twice as smart as you. <clears throat> a little Frank for you today. <laughs> all right, this is it. Monterey Jack signing off. Love all of you. Be careful. Be safe.